All right, so let's jump into it. So I did a prior video on how to live stream, live stream a pre-recorded video uh, to Facebook using um, OBS. Um, but today I want to show a, another method of how to live stream. This is not pre-recorded. This is a live method uh, to Facebook using um, a software called Zoom. Um, so to go to Zoom, there is um, this is a paid service that you want to use. So you can go here to see the plans and pricing. Um, of it so they have a free section um, here but they also have a paid version as well so in order to, to stream during this feature you're gonna want to use the um, paid version and you're going to want to set up the ability to be able to um, use webinars so you're gonna want to be able to do the video webinar um, plan so this is the plan you want to get the plan starting at around $40 um, a month and this will allow you to stream unlimited to Facebook live and to YouTube live as well so um, let's go ahead and jump into my account real quick so we want to do to get set up want to do schedule not actually a meeting we want to do schedule a webinar and we'll go here schedule a webinar and let's just do um, Facebook live test and then we'll just schedule it uh, we'll just leave it here because we're, we're doing a test so you can set the date and time here um, when you're going to do it uh, if you want to do it re uh, recurring if you want people to register um, you can do that as well if you want to have host or panelists on then you can turn these on as well and then this is just the audio I'll just leave that at default um, and then this is if you require a password or um, if you want to enable a practice section so that's just basically before you go live uh, you can go into practice mode to make sure all your technology and everything's working before you actually go live and this is if you want to record uh, the webinar so if you want to record it automatically uh, set it to local and in the cloud this is especially good especially if you're going to be sending out a replay of the webinar and then there's just some advanced options here if you want to have alternate host um, you can just invite them via email uh, but for this we're not going to record it since it's a test uh, definitely will leave Q&A on if you want to enable questions um, and then let's go so now all you have to do is hit schedule all right and then here's some options if you want to um, integrate any systems or uh, set up any branding or anything you can do that here uh, but just for this training here um, it has Facebook Live, Facebook Workplace, and YouTube Live. But um, we're not going to adjust any of that. We're just going to start the webinar. And I'm going to show you how easy it is to stream it to Facebook Live. All right, so I'm here. And then I want to, let's just do turn audio on. Um, so the audio is there. And if we want to turn video on as well, we can do that. Just for the test, we'll turn the video on. Hey, um, so let's go in here and let's share it here just click on more on your toolbar here and you'll see the different options to stream um, we're going to just go live on Facebook is what you want to choose and then it'll bring it to your Facebook page and then you have options you can share it directly to your timeline um, share it on a friend's timeline in a group or set up an event but we're going to do here for this uh, training we're going to share it on a page you manage um, I'm going to come to one of just my test pages here let's do the I love running um, page and then let's go to next all right and then it's preparing the live stream to preview okay so it'll pull up the preview there obviously that is me it's I will mention it is a um, slight delay so we're just going to call this uh, Facebook Live. This is just the description. Uh, we'll just do the title there just so we have a title. Um, I just put the same thing in there. But if you have different descriptions or links that you want to have people go through um, or just give a description of the actual call that you're doing, you can put that there. We're going to go live here. so we can see it on our actual page all right so now we're redirecting to Facebook live and let's go here to the page here this is the page that I'm streaming on let me just refresh it real quick 
perfect. And there we go, the test is live there. Um, from here, if you wanted to um, share the post into any groups or to another page and stuff, this is where you could do it at, or vice versa, if you're in a group and you wanna share it to a page, you can do that um, as well. And that is it. I typically just share it to the page because those are public. Um, and if p anyone that's following your page and stuff, you can get there. Or if you just wanna do it to a special select group of people, a closed group that you have, then you can share it into a group. Um, but that is pretty much it. And then you can come back here to the controls. Um, you can see here that we're live on Facebook. Um, if you want to um, copy it, you can view, actually view the live stream link here. Uh, for testing purposes and then that is it um you're done to end the meeting uh just click on end meeting and then that is it it will end it like i said there's a slight delay there um it's about a 20 to 30 second delay so there's going to be a delay on facebook uh, from the actual live stream so this is a good way to um just to get your webinars or your live streaming videos out there um, to more people to get a bigger reach or a bigger audience. I'm um, hoping you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, just drop them in the uh, comments below. And also, if you haven't liked or subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. I'm going to be dropping a lot more videos on technology and systems you can use to grow your business.